My team supports um, the entire CVS health company. We have Aetna Insurance, as well as our pharmacy businesses, as well as our retail. So you can imagine the challenges of having all these different types of consumers and different types of laws that apply to how you manage that data. So for us, that was a big piece is sort of even getting down with legal and making sure we understand what we're allowed to do to keep our customers' privacy at, at the forefront. So making sure that we're protecting their interests. Um, and that really goes into how we've built everything in a privacy-centric way, but also in, in, in you know, enabling each team to have sort of the same type of capabilities with their unique data sets. So my team in particular is a data and analytics team as well as a personalization team, really laying that foundation of, of data prior to even launching some of the content or the experiences to make sure we're actually actioning the right data. We can actually measure what we get into market. We can prove the value. So that was a big piece and that's where my team, I think really excelled and in, in shown, right? Coming up with these innovative ways and getting in there, getting their hands dirty. Data is such an important backbone of what we talk about with the experience economy, but it's often like the unsung hero. I will sing the praises of data any day. Um, that is my passion, I think, is, is really how do we leverage data uh, in more effective ways? And how do we think about the right data to capture or the right data to use in certain profiles that could unlock opportunities for other teams? We really value the fact that the Adobe tools fit together and have this sort of full circle from the data that we collect that can create the profile to the data that is then used for measurement and feeds back in. So for us, there's some efficiency in having that full stack um, and it unlocks a little bit more um, scale for our users, right, in terms of learning one tool versus multiple tools. What's one thing not on your LinkedIn profile that helps you with what you do for work every day? I'm a doodler. I have three kids and so I draw them pictures every day. But for me, that's actually been a really useful tool in terms of how do we talk about our work. As you talk about these projects, it can get a little dry. And so one thing our team I think has really refined is how we plan, how we demonstrate our roadmaps, and how we socialize our success. You cannot underestimate the power of a whiteboard is all I'm saying.